Yo, what's up guys? It's Curtis coming at you from the Las Vegas location. Here at it with another review video for you. So this time we actually got another two pair of shoes. I'm gonna break it up into two, make it a little bit easier. But, they are both from the Powerwall series. 2006, golden year for Nike, I think. So first I'm gonna start out with the Nike Air Max 180. Now this one, as I mentioned, came out with the Powerwall series. Uh, now Nike did the Powerwall series um, for their 25th anniversary of the Nike Air series. So they did something like 20 to 30 models and it was all different shades of colors ranging from different tiers. This was uh, part of the BRS series, uh, a tribute to their Blue Ribbon Sports Division. That was an early, early stage of Nike. So they did all the colors in their BRS iterations of Nikes back in the day. So this one's got some pretty cool colors all over it. Uh, it's pretty much draped all over in red. Two different shades with the two different materials here. This one's got kind of like a fuchsia darker red here, which I think contrasts really well with that sheen of the uh, toe box here, that bright red. Now the laces, now this was way back in 2006 before the crazy funky laces came about, but of course Nike ahead of their game. One of my favorite features of this one is the uh, orange swoosh here. Really low key, but a nice detail, I think. This one has the Air 180 Air unit. You can see still intact after all these years. Beautiful shoe. Old school Nike logo on the tongue tag. And if you aren't a fan of the bright yellow, you want to tone it down a little bit, it also gives you another lace option here. So that's got the gray with the red and the blue which I think still plays really well with the colors here. Super, super cool shoe to have in hand. Really lightweight, and I think the 180 model in particular is very underrated. So it's nice to see them do fun stuff like this with it. Kind of recreate it and give it a little bit more life, I think. Pretty cool. So let's check out this other pair that we have from the Powerwall series. This one is done in the pink shades. So as you see here, it's a very light, dusty pink. And if you look real closely in the mid panels and along the toe guard and the mud guard here, you see some white riding. Very subtle detail that you see when you look closely, but from afar, it just looks like an all over pink shoe, which is pretty cool. I really like that they went with the classic mesh here on the toe as opposed to like a leather. I think it wears better and it ages better in my opinion. Air Maxes get those gnarly creases and they're done for. These still look beautiful after all these years. So of course the contrast, that light, light, delicate pink, they have this kind of dark blood red lace. And then of course the dark red hit in the back. Super nice, I love the leather, the leather quality, even the mesh quality is just real soft and flexible. And then, of course, toned down with a, just a black sole. With the Powerwall series here, it's pretty cool. You see they did this kind of footprint on the insole. I don't know if you could see that there. It's like a blue footprint. So just two classics from the Air Max line. Just one of many from the Nike archive. Some of my favorites, I think. And I know you Air Max guys will be drooling over these right now. So if you've never seen them in person, I definitely recommend it. Swing on by the shop and check them out. If you guys like what you see here, go ahead and leave a comment, like, and subscribe to 2J's videos. Appreciate it, guys.